All right, everyone, it's time to get head. Drum head. We're talking about drum heads. When you go to your local music store, you're gonna see all these stacked up on a shelf like this, and there's gonna be a million of them, and you're gonna get all scared and confused. You're not gonna know what to do or what to buy, and you're gonna run away. Don't be scared, just turn on Happy KO on your YouTube. Let us walk you through what to look for. First things first, you're gonna wanna know what size, what length, of the drum head you want. You can use anything to measure this. You can use a ruler, a tape measure. Like for example, if it's six inches and it goes halfway, you know that you have a 12 inch drum head. Or if it's like Drew's, he can lay his across a 10 inch drum head and it'll go all the way across. Okay, so once you figure out the length of your drum head, you match it with the number here on the side. Find a 10 inch, Perfect. Then you look at uh, underneath, it says one ply coated on this one. And this is the equivalent of the girth, okay? One ply means it's just, it's, it has one layer of coating on it right here. So it kind of has this like stuff on it that when you rub it, it's kind of rough. Actually, I'll show you one that doesn't have right here. This one has zero ply. It's just smooth. Rough, smooth, okay? So once you figure out what kind of ply you want and you have the right length, if you have the right length and girth, if you will, then you're gonna wanna pull out, okay? Pull, pull out, which is a safe method. Then you're gonna look at this description here. This basically describes how, how the head might sound, if you will. Um, attack, defined and balanced. For Evans, this is how it's gonna look. Attack, um, you can look at define and balance. Mine said balanced. I don't really know what that means. Um, I don't really care about that though. It's all, all snare drums are gonna sound loud when you first hit them anyways. Sustain, I went with a long sustain on mine. So this is when you hit the drum, it'll go like that. That's a long sustain. Short sustain would be like uh, Women especially prefer a long sustain. Women usually prefer a long sustain. Men uh, sometimes prefer a short sustain, but that's just, you know, that's just generalizations. Most people um, have their own individual preference. Okay, tone, we have bright and dark. This is, this is kind of the color of, of the drum sound, if you will. A bright tone is like tss, tss up there, and a dark tone is like tss, tss, it's kind of lower. This is, uh, again, personal preference. Some people like dark tones. There's nothing wrong with that. And some people like bright, bright tones. Drew's kind of like, um, his is maybe a couple shades darker than most of the other parts of him, parts of his, his music gear. So uh, uh, durability, this is uh, an obvious one. This is physical durability. Okay, how long can you, can you jack, jack, off, jack up your drum? Uh, until it breaks, if you will, if it, you know, explodes or rips or breaks or something. How long can you jack it up, all right? Um, so that's Evans. <laughs> Remo is similar thing. The numbers here for the length, girth here, um, coded, right? Pull out, pull out method. And then on the back here, it'll have each kind. I went with the Emperor for this. This is actually this tom right here. They have the same types of descriptions here. Tone, warm tone means kind of lower end, right? Not up here, tss, tss, tss. it's more of a tss, tss, tss. lower, warmer tone. Sustain, same thing, medium sustain for this. This one I went with a uh, medium sustain because I didn't want that one to last too long. This one I'm okay lasting a long time. That one not so much, okay? Uh, durability, same thing. I went with maximum durability on this. Um, I plan on abusing that one a little bit more. So I hit that one a little harder. I hit this one a little softer. Um, thanks for watching. I hope you learned a thing or two. And uh, thank you for filming, Drew. Or your own penis. And what you do is you lay it down on the drum head whilst erect. 
And if you know the length of your penis already, 